Hello to all my viewers. This is Dr. Dawal Mehta and today we are going to discuss Citation Jacko which is used for advanced literature review. Citation Jacko is a user-friendly graphical interface designed for mapping interconnections between academic paper references. The web-based tool offers a hassle-free experience requiring no downloads or account creation. Within seconds, users can begin using the platform which comes equipped with built-in search functions to help them discover new research references. With the capabilities of Citation Jacko, users can swiftly compile a collection of research papers pertinent to their subject of interest. The tool facilitates the visualization of the relationships and similarity between various papers. Furthermore, it aids in the identification of the articles that are gaining significant citations within a particular field. Once the user has meticulously curated their list of references, Citation Jacko provides a functionality to export this list in the .bab file format, commonly used for bibliographic purposes. This feature allows for effortless integration into popular reference management software. Now let's see how we can use this tool. For this, we will go in Google and we will write down Citation Jacko. Click on the first link. Wait for some time. When you get this window, you don't have to click on this yellow. You will have to click on this second link and that is Citation Jacko is to be activated. So click here to start exploring your literature. Click here. Now start discovering the papers. Click on search for papers. So you can either write the title of the journal, the title of the paper, the keywords, I'm writing the keywords customer relationship management search you'll get the list of papers now you can make any one of them paper as your seed paper uh, more commonly it has been said that authors normally uh, make their own paper as their seed paper. So let me identify some papers which are there. Let's pick up this one, two and three. Uh, click here and select it as seed papers. Now click outside this box in the canvas and you can see here uh, this is the seed paper. So if you will click on it, right? So this paper is a seed paper and the references which has been used in this paper are highlighted. Okay. Now, you can also change the diagram from here. Just click on, click here and you'll get this diagram. Now, if I want to add more seeds, I'll click here, add more seeds, search for papers. Okay. I'll write down the same thing, customer relationship management. Search. And this time I'll click all of them. And I'll make all of them as seed and select it as seed papers. Now click outside this box and you can see the 3D diagram which is which the software has generated. So this is your seed paper. Now again click here. So these are the recommended papers uh, which are being used to create this seed paper. You can click on the filters. There are many filters which you can activate. Let's see one by one. Add the filter. So, uh, if I want to go according to the year, the filtration according to the year, so I'll only include those papers which are in, which have been published from 2017 to 2019. So, this is the first filter which is according to the year. I can add the filter according to the journal also. Journal is the name of the journal. I'll give the name of the journal. I can also activate 
the filter seeds cited by that how many time or how many uh, authors have cited this paper so by uh, activating the logical operator less than or more than i can specify the seed here now there is a small button here papers cited by the seed papers and papers citing the seed papers as soon as i lower this button you can see the changes which are happening and when i increase well, sorry when i uh, activate papers cited by seed papers so i'll get this diagram by scrolling the mouse you can see the entire galaxy of papers which are there now let's see uh, what is the advantage of using this Jacko citation. I'll click here. So this paper is a seed paper, which means that to create this paper, all these references have been used. Now, if I want to change the seed, what I can do is I can click on this and on left hand side, it will show me the paper. I'll double click on it. And I'll just click on add as seed. So this will become my seed paper now i hope you got it now if i want to get the paper this is also very easy i'll click here and it will directly take me that where this paper is located so i got the paper uh it is an open access paper the pdf is also available let's go back on the diagram now, what is the difference between papers cited by seed papers and papers citing the seed paper? Okay, let's try to understand. When it is papers cited by the seed paper, this means that to create this paper, all these references have been used. Now, when I will lower this, so which are the papers which are using this seed? To take the references okay that's the difference is very simple this one is that to create this seed paper what are the papers used but the reverse is that which are the papers which are using this seed paper so if I want to know this I will lower this now all those papers which are selected here when I just simply press save session it will be saved as dot bib which can be used for bibliometric analysis so quite a uh, useful website this was all about citation jacko for more videos on ai tools used for literature review kindly subscribe to my channel you can follow me on linkedin and twitter please refer my playlist in which i already uploaded many videos on literature review using ai tools don't forget to subscribe to the channel, press the like button and share.